Now you might have seen this tall grass known as Guinea grass and it might be growing in your backyard or around the coastal bend. Well, this morning, Sunrise reporter Cordero McMurray, he tells us how the Oso Bay Wetlands Preserve is managing this grass harming their ecosystem. This African grass is called Guinea grass, and it's causing a major problem here in the ecosystem at Oso Bay Wetlands. Guinea grass is a grass that was brought here from Africa, and when given some support, can grow much taller than I am, six, seven, eight foot into our canopy. So it is our constant battle out here trying to do habitat management. Sarah Jost, the preserve manager at Oso Bay Wetlands Preserve, says the African Guinea grass was brought over to Texas to feed cows back in the 60s. If you look at the globe, not too different from Africa as far as where we are from the equator and what our climate is like. But Texas is not crawling with wildebeest and antelope and zebra. So it's doing really well here. So well that it outcompetes everything else. Josie says the problem with the guinea grass is it smothers other plants growing in the area and makes it harder for animals to move through the plants and trees. So we like to get the guinea grass off of the landscape where we can to give those plants we want that make this a healthy environment space to grow. With a maintenance staff of three covering the 162 acres, Josie says getting volunteers to help them makes a big difference. I honestly thought that guinea grass was a part of just South Texas in general because you see it everywhere. Um, I really didn't know that it was such an invasive species and how much harm it can cause to like the native plants around here. Leah Swinney, who volunteered through the Corpus Christi American Meteorology Society Club at TAMUCC says they removed about 14 bags of guinea grass. So we were out there for a few hours and it was actually kind of refreshing. Just cleaning up, doing some work and just kind of helping out. If you'd like to be a volunteer and help remove some guinea grass here at Oso Bay Wetlands, just visit our website at ChrisTV.com. Reporting in Corpus Christi, I'm Cordero McMurray, Chris, Six Sunrise.